Hi, this is Trey Baxter. Welcome to uh, my uh, reaction and review of uh, Game Five, Game Five, <laughs> Season Five of Game of Thrones. Okay, a fellow YouTuber um, uh, contacted me on Facebook. I got a notification saying that it's out, so I want to see it in all its glory. And uh, big Game of Thrones fan, so I'll give the YouTuber credit. Put his name over this video here, uh, and thank you for alerting me to this. I'm a big Game of Thrones fan, and as you see in the title, this will be pancakes as well, so I'm going to eat my pancakes right after I see this Game 5 trailer. Game, why keep saying Game 5? Season 5 <laughs> trailer of Game of Thrones, which I'm a big fan of. Okay, so let's uh, work this magic. I had to make sure I had a few false starts before I could get this, so let me see if I can do this right now properly. Okay, so uh, make sure that the volume is turned all the way up, and uh, hopefully, like I said, um, because usually they put music in this, so I may not have to can't monetize this because YouTube will block it if I try to monetize this. So if this has any music in it, I'll, I won't do that. Okay, so let's uh, go. Nothing's more hateful than failing to protect the one you love. There's no justice in this world. Not unless we make it. Avenge them. I believe men of talent have a part to play in the war to come. I would never sit on the iron throne. You will be. You could help another climb those steps and take that seat. I'm not going to stop the wheel. I'm going to break the wheel. That little monster is out there somewhere drawing breath. I don't think I'm ready for what I deserve. I'll never even find what's left of you. Strip away the gold. Look down the statue. This is what remains. The Seven Kingdoms, the inspired and loved by millions, with a powerful army and a right family name. Good luck finding him. Who said anything about him? Okay, that was cool. Um, a lot of the things, I can't always remember the names, <laughs> uh, but I'll tell you what I saw, which I liked. Um, um, was the perverted guy that uh, was in love with Caitlyn Stark, who, got, who actually married the daughter now. He's basically telling her that she's got to, you know, you know, seek revenge for your family, you know. You know, basically telling her, encouraging her to seek revenge, you know, for her family. Uh, you know, Sophie Turner's character. And he saw Jon Snow, and then he also saw Varys with um, Tyron, you know, talking to him. And and he's telling, and basically they're talking about, you know, the Iron Throne and stuff and who's going to set up on it. And I think you also see the youngest, um, you know, Cersei's son uh, getting married to. Uh, I'll just say the real life characters because I can't remember. Uh, getting married to Natalie Dorman's character, you see him getting, see them actually getting married in that trailer, and then you also see uh, a couple of shots of Jon Snow in battle, and also you see uh, the guy that got cast off from the white hair, you know, from uh, well, I can't remember her name, even though I watched the show, you know, the girl with the dragons. You see the, you know, the guy that when he got busted last year because he originally was set dead to spy on her. Uh, you see him fighting in an arena, and and you see Varys is talking about her when he's talking to Tyron. Uh, 
he was looking a little haggard, you know, with the beard and stuff. And then you also see Cersei talking to Jamie, talking about he's drawing breath out there, talking about I guess she's she's gonna send people out to try to kill him wherever he is. Yeah, you know, if she can find out where he is, you know, that he's you know, spoiler, you know, he killed their father and stuff and made it out. <laughs> so uh, and escaped death as well. So she's Cersei looks like she's really pissed at him because of that and she wants to and Jamie looks all pensive and and anyway, uh and like I said, a few shots of Jon Snow and I also did see uh the guy that was treated like a dog. I saw him he's because he's in you see him one scene, a brief clip of him there. But uh, and then you see uh what's it called at the end, uh she looks like she grew a little bit, uh the youngest female star uh I forgot I can't, well, I can't remember their names. I'm sorry. She looks like uh you see her, she looks like she's grown because they show her standing up with her sword. And it looks like she's grown a lot, that she's gotten bigger. Okay, so I'm interested to see where they go with, with her story, especially with, uh, what's called, who married, uh, I don't know, uh, Sophie Turner's character. Let's see where she goes now, Zach, because it looks like, what you call it, is, uh, you know, the pervert is, uh, uh, educating her and she's becoming more of a player, you know, and because he basically encouraged her to seek revenge for her family, you know, for the deaths of her mother and all that, and her younger, you know, her older brother and stuff to seek revenge. Okay, I didn't see the youngest Stark, not the youngest Stark kid, that would be Rick, but the other one, the one that can see the visions. Uh, hopefully, he'll be on this season as well, see what his journey is. Hopefully, you know, uh, but I didn't see him unless it was really quick. I didn't see him. I watched this trailer again just to see all the other things I missed on this. But I, I like Verse, Verse and Tyron together. Yeah, <laughs> that's going to be an interesting duo on the road duo to see what they get, and also to see how Cersei's. But oh yeah, and also um, uh, what's it called his character? You know, the girl with the dragons. Which I can't never remember her name. I'm sorry about that. Because uh, she's basically saying she's gonna. She's not going to just rule the thing. She's going to tear it down. I think that's what she said. <laughs> so, and it sees her, it sees them. And then there was a scene in the, like I said, you see, you know, the guy that got cast off as a spy, which I can't remember his name, who was with the white haired, you know, future queen to be, who got cast off. You see him in an arena fat fighting. So I don't know if he gets captured and, and he has to fight in an arena because it looks like he is. Uh, I think there was a, I don't know if there was a shot of them together again, but, but, because I got to watch this trailer again, but this is my quick. I reacted to that, so I very much encouraged by you know Game of Thrones. Love that. Shit. So like I said, hopefully, like I said, I want some Starks to come together. Okay, I'm, I know that's kind of the way of wishing that may not happen for a while. So anyway, uh, back to the pancakes. Uh, I'm gonna eat that and uh, let me know what you think of Game of Thrones season five trailer. And let me know what you think, and uh, feel free to leave comments down below. And uh, let's see how these pancakes taste before I go. Uh, delicious. Okay. Trade passes, thanks a lot, and take care.